Yeah, hello everyone. Welcome back. The last time, the Jenny and I did the one single case. So right. So last time we made the uh, we made the implant plan. So today we finished our project and uh, we will show you how to design the art guide. Are you ready, Jenny? Yeah. Okay. Let's do this. Yeah, that's our implant planning. Yeah, and then we have to save it first. Yeah, the plan is fine. Yeah. Yeah. Finish. Finish. And the same project. Same. Yeah. And same project name. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. And we export to the SL file for the design, right? Yes. Uh, first. First. Change the three core. Oh uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. That's the scan of the yeah. So we have to change the three core. So there's a drill core. Yes. So we have the, the small, regular, wide drill core. Yes. So small is for the uh, the narrow implant diameter, yes. the, the so three point five. Yeah. Three point zero. Three point zero. Ah, drill core. Yeah, drill core size three point five. Yeah, I'm right. And regular is the for five point zero drill core. So it's for the regular implant. And the wide is 6.5, right? It's for the wider implant from the, like any reach, for example, any reach, uh, diameter 4.5 above, uh, they must use the wide core, right? And the, under the 4.5 diameter, we have used the regular three core and mini implant, mini implant, right? Yeah. Mini implant, we then use, we use the the small drill core. So at this time, we use the end reach 4.5 diameter. So we have to select the regular drill okay. core. Okay. Regular. Apply. Okay. Yes, yeah, change drill core. And that's the drill core. Yeah. And uh, as you see, that uh, the T shape, yeah. yeah, that is the window, right? So you have to uh, make the you have to make the direction, uh, not what direction, the window directions. Okay, yeah. So that's the posterior part. So if you see the, that window easily, you have to that win that the window direction to the front right, front direction, right? Yes. Yeah, that's the front directions. Then the, you can see more clearly the windows. Okay. okay. Ready? Done? Yeah. Done. Okay. And then that's the okay. SLF port. And there is an option for the R2 guide. It's the RWS is a special format. So if, if you, you want to use the, the r 2 wear, you have to export to the, it to RWS format. And uh, what else? Mm -hmm. And the STR with the abutment, that, that is the option. That is the option for another CAD software. Mm -hmm. So at this time, we don't need to check up that part. We need just only RWS and export. And then you have to decide the folder and the filing. And, and save it. And export is done. It's very quickly, right? And the close the art gate. And the look at the, the patient folder. At the folder, if we click the folder, yeah, it works. Gen case. Yeah, and then there will be RWS file. Can you say that? Yeah, that's RWS file. Click that file, and there is the R2 guide design button. It will be activated like this. And then click it. Click, 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 right? And this is the RWS software. Yeah, that's the, the, the model and the housing of the drill core and the drill core. Mm -hmm. So, yeah, go on, yes. And the first thing is? First thing is set insertion. Yeah, set the insertion, what was that? Insertion. View, yes, yeah. yes, it's the insertion pass, yeah. And then? Mm, yes, yeah, guide pass. Yeah, it's guide pass, yes. Yes, that's insert, guide insertion pass. Then, okay. and set up the path, and 
remove the undercut, click, and software will remove the old undercut, right? Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Let me, yeah, okay. Finish. Finish? Yeah, you can see that that, that uh, red, pink, or what color is that? Yeah, that part is the undercut part, but it's the peel with the, the removed undercut now. And then, draw, draw binder, boundary. Okay. That is the outline of the guide, right? Yes. And how to draw? Which click? Uh, right. Right, yeah. right click. Yeah, right click. Click, 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 click. Rotation. Okay. Yeah, click. Click, 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 and first point. Yeah, that's the first point, and the click the first point, and then it's the complete the draw line, right? Yeah. So normally, so what size is better for the single implant mm. when you design the guide? Uh, um, three and four tooth. Four tooth. Yeah. Cover. Oh, okay, that's more stable. Yeah. All right. And then, what's next? Cut boundary. Yeah, cut the boundary. Click it. Yeah. yeah. The, delete the, all the other area, right? And then, okay. that's the thickness. thickness. Yeah, thickness of what thickness? 3.0 three, three in English? Three point yeah, that, that thickness means it's guide thicknesses. And offset is 0 0.01 millimeters. That is, the, mm -hmm. if you make it more bigger, the offset, then the is not is is I think is can be the big more bigger than the model, so it's not fit. So our the basic offset value is zero point zero one. Normally it works, right? Okay, and then preview. what's the preview? Yeah, that's make the guide design, right? Click the preview button. Yeah, this is the guide design, and the. We have other options. Uh, yeah, easy. we can add the, some uh, the bar and the bore or something like that, right? Mm -hmm. So this is a uh, single. This is a half arch. If you want to make the the full arch, you have to make the some the structures, mm -hmm. the internal internal structures. It makes more stable guide, right? So at this time we don't need that. I'll show you next time, maybe, right? Yeah. We will do very big case next time. Okay, yeah. and and then you can add the a patient name with the text. Yeah, mm -hmm. don't put my name. Okay, I have to die. <laughs> I have to die. <laughs> yeah, and then add mm -hmm. add yes yes where yeah, yeah okay. okay just click yeah just. Left click. click? Yeah. Okay, yes. I have to buy it. And then it's finished, right? Yeah. And then what's output that? Output design. Output design. Yeah, exported design file. And then the, mm. the name and the folder okay. and save it. Same. Yeah. Oh, this is finished, right? Okay. okay. So let's see the design file. Yeah, that's the what we saved now. Yeah, this is our guide. Yeah. Okay. And then the, you send this SL file to 3D printer and uh, make, the, uh, make it the real guide, right? Hello, I'm Jenny. Let's start make the guide. Uh, this 3D printer is Megazen MacPrinter Tool Cube. There are resin for surgical guide, crown and bridge, and distal model. We will print the guide uh, using surgical guide resin. Drill core is very important part, so check it attach support. After ready to print, start printing.
finish. When the print is complete, remove the guide from the build plate. Our printer resin is washable type and can be washed only water. I will wash. Wash and dry, put in curing mask and curing guide mode. About 10 minutes. This is trimmer set. Size is narrow, regular, and wide. After trimming, hole and stopper. Using trimmer. Hole trimmer. And stopper trimmer. And then check with the drill. If you have model, check it with the guide to model. Okay, very easy, don't you? I think they will finish now. <laughs> <laughs> Already. Okay, just wait a second. The, the maybe he will bring the the surgical guide. Yeah, bring me a surgical guide, that one. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, actually, Jenny, Jenny printed the guide already. Oops, oops, oops. Yeah, this is guide. It's not finished yet. So, this is the core, and uh, this is printed model. And we have to look at like this. And uh, this is window part, right? And yeah, this is fit very well. Nice. And what else? Do you have drill also? Drills? Drill. Come on, drills. Drill. <laughs> no, just the kit. Drills. Give me, give me, give me drills. Yeah, the kit. Yeah, maybe the we can have the time to introduce our drill set. But at this time, I just check the the fitness of the drills. Yeah, these drills. Yeah, this drill is the the diameter of this part, guide part. It's 5.0. So, so exactly adapted with this guide hole, right? So like this. Okay, like this. And our R2 guide has a stopper inside. And the drill also has the stopper here. So it can stop like this. The stopper and this is window. And our guide don't have the metal slip inside. Normally other guide system has the metal slip. So after the printing the guide, they have to put the metal sleeve by manually and they adhesive the sleeve by manually. We think this is can be the error factor. So we removed all the sleeve and we just print out the guide. And then finishing it, the drill will be completely matched with this force. Yeah, this is our art guide benefit, right? Okay. And uh, this is our implant carrier, right? Yeah, here is the green color. Can you see the, the green color? This is the hex positions. So when you depress the implant, there is window. Can, you can catch it. There's window, right? So when you, when you can see the green color through the, this window, it means you the match the hex direction as the same as planned. This is this is important. So our guide system can match the, the internal hex direction also. It's very important for the the one day implant. I mean, I mean temporary crown, the delivery temporary crown or final crown. So this is our guide system. Okay. Here's a lot of the drills, but. I, I will introduce our three system next time. When? Mm, next time. <laughs> next time. Okay. And then the next time the, we will back with the more bigger case. What kind of case do you like? Mm. Full case or mm. oh. sinus? Oh. Or sinus case. Sinus case? We're going to do the sinus case next time? Yeah. Okay. The, she gonna, the, she going to prepare the <laughs> sinus case next time. With the sinus cases, we have the, a lot of things to, to, 
to tell you because we have very benefit for that, right? Okay, thank you. Thank you for watching. Bye bye. See you next time. Bye bye. Cut.